too far away you're looking at the roof hi guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl Sharon. thank you for joining guys please to subscribe to my channel on youtube guys so i have this story to share with you this one girl on facebook said that um she needs somebody advice she said she'll be with this guy for nine months and the guy is handsome and she said every time she and him have a disagreement he said that he's going to leave and she want to know how to deal with that him saying that he's leaving because it hurt her now first of all when somebody threatening that they're leaving they're going to leave all the time it's a form of abuse yes guys it is a form of abuse because he's saying that to control you or maybe to control maybe on him of an argument to control him winning the argument or to put you in place and for somebody to do that obviously he probably know that you have low self-esteem that's why you make a statement like that that he's gonna leave because a good looking woman that have self-confidence and everything who cares if you want to leave you leave you should be running behind me and obviously that's not the case because somehow he feels that he is in control right that is one thing the second thing if you want to save the relationship you need to communicate with him and ask him why him say that is it that you truly want to leave or is it that he's trying to control you or talk to him and ask him why am i why am why am why i'm behaving like that and you need to tell him how him saying that make you feel like for example all of the feeling that you get when he says it is all negative right you have your panic you have fear right it hurtful right it's not nice and yeah and that is what you want to communicate to him and let him know how you feel and make him know that listen if you say something like that to hurt me that means i believe that you're not in love with me because if you're continuously hurting me just like that just because we have an argument that can't be love right because people who love somebody don't try to hurt them all the time right what do you think another thing is they need to set the ground rules for the relationship because it's not going to get any better you need to um set the ground rules Snip and the line in the and if he's right, right before the relation because it's just going to get worse oh i need to snip it in the butt right right but, but there's the other things she that need to she need to do it so but i don't understand because she's going to be one year two years five years later and he's going to be doing the same same thing or I mean, something different but she needs to say she's not putting up with it right she shouldn't put up with it. zero tolerance you need to set boundaries right and if you set the boundaries it will follow you need to say to him well leave you need to put the set the ground rule and him say i'm leaving say okay here here your bag your stuff go leave you said you're leaving right and that's what you have to do and you have to stick to it and you have to stick to it you have to do it right because it ain't gonna get any better and if you have a man and every minute him must say my leave obviously him have somebody out there or he's thinking of leaving right because why would you, when you say it, when you, I mean, if you should ever, would you say that to a woman? Or sometimes it's just to control the relationship? It depends. Or maybe in a love a woman. I don't know, it's because sometimes, maybe he does people just I told loose. you, maybe he does Some people right. just talk loose. Right. Not, it's not really, they don't have any meaning to it. He wants to get his way and he's saying something. Say, if you don't do this, I'm going to do this. It doesn't have to, could be other things beside leaving. Some guys go drink, right? Some guys go fool around with other women. Some guys go gamble. They're not happy at home. What do they do? What do they do in Jamaica when they're not happy at home? When the wife is yelling at them or doing something they're not happy, what do they do? They go find their sweetheart. And what is, how does a sweetheart treat them? Treat them like king and queen. I don't know. Or maybe treat them good. Because, listen, you need to understand it. You go to your sweetheart, that doesn't mean anything. Because you can't go to somebody else. And just because they don't live with you every day, they don't have to deal with you every day. So when they see you for the two, three hours, of course, they're going to be nice to you. So don't be fooled. Right? Don't be fooled. Anyhow, you have to snap.